The headlines on Al Jazeera. Mohammed El Baradai has been named Egypt's interim prime minister. Baradai has held meetings with senior officials after a night of violent street protests that left at least 36 people dead. Funerals were held on Saturday in Nasser City, where supporters of deposed President Mohamed Morsi have been gathering. They vowed to continue their demonstrations until Morsi is reinstated. Syria's main opposition has elected its new leader at a meeting in Istanbul. After a close vote, Ahmad al-Jaba was chosen as the new president of the Syrian National Coalition. It comes as government troops continue a fierce assault on the city of Homs. In northern Nigeria, gunmen have killed at least 29 children and their teacher at a boarding school. Survivors of the attack in Yobe State are being treated for burns and gunshot wounds. Yvonne Ndege is in the Nigerian capital, Abuja. Well, this latest attack looks like the work of Boko Haram, the militant group who have been behind the deaths of thousands of people across northern Nigeria over the last couple of years. The group say they want a strict form of Islamic law imposed out the country and have attacked schools before for teaching Western education. And don't forget, you can watch Al Jazeera online. Head to our website, aljazeera.com, and click on the Watch Now icon. Those are the headlines on Al Jazeera. I'm Paul Brennan. Goodbye.